A how to fix brother printer won't print error, Windows. 5 quick solutions. Method 1. Check if the connection is faulty. Step 1. For a USB printer. If you are using a USB cable to connect the print system to the PC, simply unplug the cords or power cables. Then, let the device cool off for 10 minutes and reconnect the cables. Also, check if the USB port you are using is problematic. If it is, try to plug the cables into another port and see if it is working. Step 2. For a wireless printer. For wireless printer users, it is important that both are connected to the same Wi-Fi network. If they are using the same network address and still not printing, restart the router. Method 2. Verify if the printer is set as default. Step 1. First, you need to launch the run command. Step 2. To do this, tap the Windows logo key and R at the same time. Step 3. In the prompted tab, enter Control, and then press OK. Step 4. Go to the drop-down menu visible next to View by Dot and Quad. Step 5. And select the small icons option. Step 6. After that, tap on devices and printers. Step 7. In the next window, choose your brother model. Step 8. Next, click on the Set as Default Printer button. Step 9. Try to print some pages to see if this method is effective. Method 3. Verify and reset the port settings. Step 1. Go to the Printers folder and right-click on your driver. Step 2. Next, choose the Properties option, and a new screen will display. Step 3. In the following screen, choose the Ports tab option. Step 4. A list of available communication ports will be displayed. Step 5. Now, tap on the Add Port option. Step 6. Then, click New Port and select Standard TCP IP Port. Step 7. The Standard TCP IP Printer Port Wizard will appear now. Step 8. After that, tap the Next button. Step 9. Here, type the IP address in the printer name or IP address box. Step 10. If a window asks for additional port information, your computer and brother machine is unable to communicate properly. Step 11. A completing the Add Standard TCP IP Printer Port Wizard window will appear. Step 12. Then, look for the Adapter Type section. Step 13. If the communication is successful, an indication with Brother Print Server will show up.
Step 14. Now, tap on the General tab option. Step 15. Thereafter, tap the Print Test Page button. Step 16. If there is no print, click on OK and exit the Print Properties window. Step 17. Choose your model and tap on Cancel All Documents. Step 18. In the end, reinstall the drivers and restart the system. Method 4. Restart the print spooler service. Step 1. Click the Windows logo key and are in the first step. Step 2. Then, the Run Command box will open. Step 3. Now, you need to enter services.msc and tap OK. Step 4. After that, right-click the Print Spooler option. Step 5. In case it is not running, start the program. Step 6. If it has already started, tap the Restart button. Step 7. Once the print spooler service is restarted, right-click on the icon again. Step 8. Thereafter, you need to click the Properties option. Step 9. Now, choose the startup type as automatic. Step 10. In the next step, click the OK button. Method 5. Uninstall and install the driver. Step 1. On your PC, tap on Start, then go to the All Programs section. And quad. Step 2. Now, click Brother, and press the Uninstall button. Step 3. Click OK when asked to remove the software completely. Step 4. After finishing uninstallation, a prompt to restart the PC will appear. Step 5. Then, tap the Yes button, and your computer will restart. Step 6. Load the CD for Windows into your drive. Step 7. A CD-ROM menu should appear now. Step 8. Now, choose your model from the menu. Step 9. Next, select the language of your preference. Step 10. Tap on the Install Printer Driver option now. Step 11. After that, choose Network Cable Users.
Step 12. Now, the driver installation starts. Step 13. In the next step, the license agreement window will appear. Step 14. Once it does, agree to the terms and conditions to proceed. Step 15. Choose the standard installation option and press next. Step 16. Finally, click on finish and the setup is finalized. Step 17. You can turn on the firewall and restart the PC. For more such help and information, visit us at www.printertails.com or call us at 1-877-469-0297.